Hello, and I must say, it's always a real pleasure to be broadcasting from this part of the USA. We're at Lumen Field. I'm Derek Ray, in position to bring you live match commentary, and my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Watson. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. It's the United States versus Canada. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? The match is underway. Moran. Committed challenge. Oh, a lovely ball. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And she puts it away just what they wanted to see from her well I have to say the keeper's done really well on the first shot as you can see but it's gone straight to an opponent and nothing she can do about the second strike 1-0 then Andy Sullivan you well good looking play with the ball of defeat Alex Morgan has a go and keeping it out over it comes oh, no end product moving into the advanced position and played in and they could face difficulties here. Fleming. On to Becky. Quinn. Desiree Scott. Now moving the ball impressively here. The timing was perfect. Extremely sloppy in possession. Rose Lavelle. Let's fly here. Well, the keeper kept it out with a minimum of fuss, but it wasn't a great effort. Well, there you can see it. The visitors haven't been able to control possession, but when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. It's really good without the ball, and the all-around performance levels have been high. Fleming. Oh, super piece of play. Good defending in the end, and danger averted for now. Will it be? Chance, maybe. Well, they can keep possession now. Well, I don't think they've been at it today, but maybe, just maybe, that great save will inspire them now. Well, maybe a chance for them now to relieve the pressure by stringing a few passes together. Can they get in behind them? Oh, could be! And it goes! The leveller! Thrilling stuff here! Well, as you can see, it's a decent strike, but I'm not sure about the keeper here. She can't be beaten inside that near post. So back 
underway. They've leveled it at 1-1 one, one here. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. of challenge put in she has teammates around her long range effort she's made sure nothing came of that Sonnet still passing it around with authority well, the keeper had to concentrate well, they've been frustrated for quite a while now, but these fans have suddenly come to life. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Making sure nothing untoward happened. It's still alive. Another time for cool heads. Well, you sense the goal's coming. They're getting so close now, they just need to take one of these chances. Yes, so near indeed, but now they've got to concentrate on keeping their defensive shape. Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and just look at that finish. 1v1 against the keeper, and she hits it with power. It's a great goal. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Rose Lavelle. Sullivan. On to Sauerbrunn. Kelly O'Hara into the final 20 minutes strong but fair tackle Janine Becky Quinn promising looking attack deciding to go inside Well, here we can see it again, and no wonder the manager is furious. They just have to get tighter here, deal with the danger, otherwise that's the outcome. Not good enough defensively. Well, that's a tale of four goals in this match now. Three, one it is. Just ten minutes to go. Lavelle. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Could play it in. Well, misfiring without any shadow of a doubt. To, to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Well, she has no intention of parting with the ball. But just like that, possession changes hands. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. And there goes the final whistle, much to the disappointment of their supporters. Well, Derek, they weren't at their best today, both as individuals and as a team, and they didn't deserve anything from the game. They need a much better display next time out.